16 hours after the shooting, Merrimack police were continuing their search for evidence as they tried to piece together what happened. At this point, we're still trying to determine the exact cause of the shooting. Merrimack police say 22-year-old Jackson Crawford shot the victim in the torso. The shooting happening around 6 o'clock Wednesday evening in the parking lot of a boat ramp on Mill Street. The victim was taken to a hospital in Nashua before being transferred to one in Burlington, Massachusetts. Police say they're still looking into the motive. We don't believe it was an entirely random act. However, we're still investigating all the aspects of this crime. A couple of hours after the shooting, Crawford was found. Essentially at 8 p.m., officers uh, were patrolling the area, located three subjects walking on DW Highway down in the south end of town by number 50 DW Highway. Robert Brown of Nashua and a juvenile were with Crawford, according to police. Officers were concerned they were armed, so they stopped them at gunpoint. Two of the subjects uh, comply with our orders. Uh, one subject just continued walking and then eventually comply with our orders. Later on the, in the evening, we were able to find a, find a firearm, which makes us feel a lot better that it's off the street. Police say the juvenile was questioned and released. However, Crawford faces several charges, including attempted murder. As for Brown, he's been charged with robbery, resisting detention, and falsifying physical evidence. As you take a live look here in Merrimack, what police were searching for here in this area was the getaway vehicle, which is described as an older model blue Toyota Corolla with one window shot out. As for the two suspects, they are scheduled to be arraigned in about an hour. Reporting live in Merrimack, Ray Brewer, WMUR News 9.